What is going on, riders? As usual, MJ here, and we are here to talk about unusual combination. Electric scooters, obviously, and motorcycle race suit. Is it the newest trend or is it an overkill? We'll talk about that in a minute. Each year, electric scooters are becoming more powerful. They have higher top speeds and more aggressive acceleration. There's no surprise that riders have started to look for some extra protection. Helmets, gloves, elbow and knee protectors, back and hip protectors, jackets. But what if you could have everything in one place? In motorcycle race suit. They have all the protectors that you might need and this great protection from the wind. If you are looking to buy one, first of all, you have to figure out which one do you need. One piece suit is basically designed for track riding and usually offers a bit more protection. It has limited mobility and is a bit impractical for most other forms of riding. So putting it simply, it's for motorcycles. Two piece suit is more comfortable and more suitable for casual street riding. It offers almost less <laughs> Jesus Christ, almost the same protection level. If you stop somewhere for some snacks or coffee, you'll be able to take off your jacket and still look normal. Or you can even combine your race jacket with jeans, which would look a bit strange if you ask me, but hey, maybe jeans is your thing. Or maybe you're looking for some more casual look. I am sure you have noticed this aerodynamic hump on race suits. It's basically designed to improve aeroflow behind your helmet. So unless you are riding at least 150 kph in low seated position, you don't need it. Now let's talk about size. You can always buy a race suit online, right? It's very easy, fast. But if you have possibility to go into physical store and put it on, do this and see if it fits well. I cannot stress enough that motorcycle suits should be snug but not restrictive. You don't want it to be billowing in the wind like a parachute. But also, you want to keep your full range of movement. Undersuit. Trust me, you want to be wearing that. You don't want your skin to get stuck under your race suit. It's easy to wash, no sweaty and smelly race suits. You get the picture, right? So no reasons not to wear it. Wear it. Gloves. The most important thing Good fit and good feel for your controls, especially accelerator and brake. Boots. It's not motorcycle you're riding on, so simply avoid all slippery boots and go with whatever style matches your racing suit style best. How do you feel about combining motorcycle race suit with an electric scooter? And what are you looking for when choosing your gear? Style? Safety? Both? The spring is here. So we can go outside and get some kilometers under our belt. So have a good one.